All right, I have here an XR-77A80J, and I'm gonna show you how to remove the back cover. We have over here in this corner, a secret little tab. I'm using a little tool here to pry it up, and this will come out. We have another one equivalent over here, but this time, instead of going from the top, I'm gonna go from the side, and same thing. We're gonna pry that out. We'll put those over to the side. Next thing is I'm going to start pulling on this and lifting it up. We have the main board here, so I'm gonna skip that area. All right, and we're gonna lift. So when I'm lifting this, I'm lifting it up, but I am pulling this away from the TV in this direction. So I'm giving it kind of this angle. I'm gonna do it a lot more forcefully than you should, but this is how we're pulling on it, and that's gonna unlock it. So we're bending away and pulling up. We'll do the same over on this side. Okay, and then the rest will just jiggle off. And if it doesn't, just same thing, bend and pull away, and there we go. That's how you remove the back cover. Okay, next I'm gonna show you how to remove the main board. To remove the main board, we're first going to start by removing the shrouds, and we're just wiggling these off, and that'll help us expose some of these screws. Next, we do wanna make sure we remove the connectors and ribbons, so we have a couple clips here, and we're putting pressure on the center clip here, same over here. Now for these ribbons, we have a little metal tab right here at the edge. So I'm gonna press that down and very gently wiggle it. Same over here. For these larger ribbons, we're gonna press down on these black tabs at the same time. So I'll do that with one hand and wiggle out the ribbon with my other hand. We'll do the same thing on this one down here. So we're putting pressure on the two tabs and gently removing the ribbon. Okay, and our final step is to remove the screws. Now we can remove it, but there is gonna be a couple pads on the bottom that are sticking the board to the chassis, so you'll just wanna very gently wiggle it out, and it's these guys over here, so you don't wanna to put too much pressure, just be very gentle when you wiggle it out. Because these boards are no longer available for sale, we do have a mail-in repair service where we do fix these on a component level. If you're interested in sending in your main board for repair, we'll have a link in the video description down below. Otherwise, if you wanna check out how we fix these, we'll have a video right over here for you to check out. If you found the content helpful or useful, make sure to leave us a like, subscribe for more, and thank you for watching.